Today we're going to be discussing one of the issues that have, has been raised by training officers. What to do if the trainee start date is in January or February. However, your LORs have only been submitted in August or September. So this is a quick demonstration of what you would do to ensure that these the, the, the correct LORs pull into the correct dates. The first thing that you would need to do as a trainee is log in using your eight digit SACA ID followed by your password. Once you log in, you'll be able you'll land onto your dashboard where you'll be able to see all of the LORs that have currently been um, submitted, as well as a button for your PD for creating your PDS. When you click create PDS, you will see that only two uh, the two LORs appear in this month. If there were LORs that were submitted um, in August, however, they weren't appearing. This is due to the, uh, the trainee's assessment start date over here. As you can see that this trainee's assessment start date is February the 1st, and they are currently on a six month cycle. So this means that the trainees, the trainees PDS period would run from the 1st of February all the way till the end of the end of July. If this trainee had submitted LORs in, in August and they weren't appearing, how this issue would be resolved uh, is by the training officer logging into the profile and updating the trainee's assessment start date to a later start date. This will allow the, this will allow the, the LORs that have been submitted in August to now appear in your PDS. How you can fix the assessment uh, end date of the PDS cycle is that you can fix it by shortening your PDS uh, period end date. Don't forget that the EAT allows you to have a, sh you can have a shorter PDS period. However, you can't have a longer PDS period than what's been selected. So let me illustrate how a training officer would update the trainee's assessment start date. I'm going to log in as a training officer. Navigate to the trainee. Select update trainee details. And then I would change the assessment start date here to a later start date and click save. That's how you amend the PDS period start date if the LORs are not appearing when the trainee creates the PDS. Thank you.